The black buck is an ungulate species of antelope native to the Indian subcontinent that has been classified as near threatened by IUCN since 2003, as its range has decreased sharply during the 20th century. The native population is stable, with an estimated 50,000 individuals as of 2001. The black buck is the only living species of the genus antelope. Its generic name stems from the Latin word antelopus, a horned animal. The specific name cervicapra is composed of the Latin words capra, she goat, and cervus, deer. Characteristics Black bucks generally resemble gazelle, found on the Arabian Peninsula. Black bucks are slender with a head to body length of about 120 cm. They are about 73.7 to 83.8 cm high at the shoulder. Males are larger than females. Adult males range in weight from 34 to 45 a kg. Females weigh 31 to 39 a kg. The tail is short and compressed. Both sexes are white on the belly, around the eyes and on the inside of the legs. They differ in the coloration of the head and back. Female and young black bucks are yellowish fawn colored on the back and on the outside of the limbs. The lower parts are white. The two colors are sharply divided by a distinct pale lateral band. Old male bucks are blackish brown on the back, on the sides and front of the neck. They become almost black with age, only the nape remains brownish rufous, and the pale lateral band disappears. Only males have horns that are diverging, cylindrical, spiral, and ring throughout. The rings are closer together near the skull. The turns of the spiral vary from less than 3 to 5. Horns are 45.6 a euro 68.5 a cm long. Horns can be as long as 71 a cm. Black bucks closely resemble cobs. Albinism in black buck is rare and caused by the lack of the pigment melanin. Wildlife experts say the biggest problem with these albinos is they are singled out by predators and hunted. Distribution and Habitat in the 19th century, black bucks ranged in open plains from the base of the Himalayas to the neighborhood of Cape Comorin, and from the Punjab to Lower Assam. They were abundant in the northwestern provinces, Rajaterna, parts of the Deccan, and on the plains near the coast of Orissa and Lower Bengal. Herds occasionally comprised several thousand animals of both sexes and all ages. Today, the black buck population is confined to areas in Maharashtra, Odisha, Punjab, Rajasthan, Haryana, Gujarat, Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu and Karnataka, with a few small pockets in central India. They occur in several protected areas of India including, Velavada National Park a Euro is home to a large population estimated at 1500 individuals in the mid-1990s. Point Calamir Wildlife and Bird Sanctuary, Talkapa Sanctuary, National Chambal Sanctuary. Kieladio National Park, Rainbenna Wildlife Sanctuary, Great Indian Busted Sanctuary, Kama Wildlife Sanctuary, Gur Forest National Park, Gwindi National Park, Ranthampa National Park, Source and Blackbuck Conservation Reserve, Baran, Rajasthan, Shurga Sanctuary, Baran, Rajasthan, in Nepal. The last surviving population of blackbuck is found in the Blackbuck Conservation Area south of the Bardia National Park. In 2008, the population was estimated at 184. In Pakistan, black bucks are irregular vagrants moving along the border areas with India. They are kept in enclosures in the Lal Suinra National Park for possible reintroduction. They are considered extinct in Bangladesh. Two subspecies are recognized, A.C. Cervicapra, A.C. Rajatani, black bucks were introduced to Argentina and the USA. These populations numbered about 43,600 individuals at the turn of the century. Ecology and Behavior Black bucks generally live on open plains and open woodlands in herds of 5 to 50 animals with one dominant male. They are very fast. Speeds of more than 80 a km per hour have been recorded. They are primarily grazers and avoid forested areas. They require water every day and may move long distances in search of water and forage in summer. Usually, they feed during the day. Their diet consists mostly of grasses, but they have occasionally been observed browsing on acacia trees in the Kalistan Desert. 
In the Vallevada National Park, they were observed feeding on pods of Prosopidula flora during seasonal lows in forage quality. Their chief predator was the now extinct Asiatic cheetah. Currently, wolves are the main predators of both fawns and adults. Fawns are also hunted by jackals. Village dogs are reported to kill fawns but are unlikely to successfully hunt and kill adults. The maximum lifespan recorded is 16 years and the average is 12 years. Threats The main threats to the species are poaching, predation, habitat destruction, overgrazing, diseases, inbreeding and sanctuary visitors. Large herds once roamed freely on the plains of North India, where they thrived best. During the 18th, 19th and the first half of the 20th centuries, black buck was the most hunted wild animal all over India. Until India's independence in 1947, many princely states hunted this antelope and Indian gazelle, the chinkara, with specially trained captive Asiatic cheetahs. It once was one of the most abundant hoofed mammals in the Indian subcontinent, so much so that as late as early 1900s, naturalist Richard Lidecker mentioned herds of hundreds in his writings. Today, only small herds are seen, largely inside reserves. The chief cause of their decline is excessive hunting. Though the royal sport had ended, farmers of the expanding areas of cultivation saw it as crop raider, further leading to its decline. Eventually, when in the 1970s, several areas reported their extinction, it was listed as a protected animal under the Wildlife Protection Act of 1972. The black buck is hunted for its flesh and its skin. Although Indian law strictly prohibits the hunting of these endangered animals, occasional incidents of poaching still occur. The remaining populations are under threat from inbreeding. The natural habitat of the black buck is being encroached upon by man's need for arable land and grazing ground for domesticated cattle. Exposure to domesticated cattle also exposes them to bovine diseases. Its protected status has gained publicity through a widely reported court case, in which one of India's leading film stars, Salman Khan, was sentenced to five years imprisonment for killing two black bucks and several endangered shinkaras, in some protected area. The court case was prompted by intense protests from the Bishnoi ethnic group, which holds animals and trees sacred, and on whose land the hunting had taken place. Salman Khan was also in trouble for driving his land cruiser and crashing it into two men, during the early 2000s. In another notorious incident of criminal poaching, Mansoor Ali Khan Fataudi also killed a black buck, one, and then absconded as a fugitive. He finally surrendered only when the case was transferred from the criminal court to a special environment court, where he would face lighter sentencing. Conservation In India, Hunting of black bucks is prohibited under the Wildlife Protection Act of 1972. Black bucks can be seen in zoos. Black bucks are protected in Abohar Wildlife Sanctuary, Punjab, Bagdara Wildlife Sanctuary, Madhul Pradesh, Indian Institute of Technology Madras, Tamil Nadu, Indian Wild Ass Sanctuary, Gujarat, Kanna National Park, Madhul Pradesh, Kurthar National Park, Pakistan. Jayamanguli Black Buck Reserve, Karnataka, Mahavaharina Vanisthali National Park, Andhra Pradesh, Rahakurai Sanctuary, Maharashtra, Sathyamangalam Wildlife Sanctuary, Tamil Nadu, Valanad Black Buck Sanctuary, Tamil Nadu, they are also found in open areas near Dindri, Madhul Pradesh at Karobani Black Buck Conservation Area, which is located about 15 a km from Dindri and also near Koppal in Koppal district about 15 a km from its headquarters. In Balahat Lane, Kola Goldfield black bucks are found in unprotected area. In culture, the black buck is known by various names such as Pulvak, Tharugamayan, Dlimaan, Kadmayan, Iralai, Kurunshikidi and Murugamayan in Tamil. It is also known as Krishna Muruga in Kannada and as Krishna Jinka in Telugu. It has been declared as the state animal of Andhra Pradesh and Telangana. Other local names for the species include Krishnasha in Bengali, Kalaharan, Sarsin, Iralai Man, and Kalvit in Marathi. It is often simply called Indian antelope, though this term might also be used for other antilobinae from the region. The skin of Krishnamogam plays an important role in Hinduism, 
and Brahmin boys are traditionally required to wear a strip of unleathered hide after performing a paninam. According to the Hindu mythology Black Buck or Krishna Jinka is considered as the vehicle of the moon god Chandrama. According to the Garuda Purana of Hindu mythology, Krishna Jinka bestows prosperity in the areas where they live. References External links, Ultimate Ungulate, Antilope Cervicapra, BBC Nature, Black Buck, Ratish Narrow Photography, Images of Black Buck